What's going on, my beautiful people? Happy Monday to everybody out there. Uh, guys, thanks for stopping by D-Reads Heat. Today, we will be doing our favorite thing, right? And that is unboxing the sneaker, okay? And this one right here is gonna be another first. And you guys already know there is nothing like the first time. Okay, I, I might need a little pause on that one, but <laughs> needless to say, y'all, hey, <laughs> I gotta tell y'all this off top. So, I started this video already and I did the unboxing and then there was a era with the computer. So, you guys don't get the fun and enjoyment of seeing me actually open the box again, but here it is, okay? There's the box. So once again, I do truly apologize to everyone uh, since you won't see the actual motion, but I will let you guys know that this sneaker released on the second, which was Friday. Um, and if you guys checked out my last review, then you absolutely know that it is not the Carbon 350. So that off top eliminates one sneaker. So what is it that I will be showing you guys today? <laughs> Without further ado, y'all, let's get into it. There you have. You guys see that HU on top. You see that Adidas. And then you guys also see that Pharrell Williams. Okay. So this is the HU N M D. And this is a seven and a half. And there is no official colorway on this box. So, hey. Okay, y'all. Um, inside the box, we do get uh, that Adidas tissue paper right there. Okay. I will have to tell you guys, this is my first NMD, okay? And I want you guys to tell me if you thought that this was slept on, okay? Because uh, right when this released at, I believe it was noon, I actually was in the car, had both phones in hand, and it told me that I was waiting in line. I had the opportunity to make it all the way back to the office and get on the desktop and log in and the desktop got me through. So being on both phones for nearly 30 minutes and I was still able to get through on the desktop. Now, I don't know if that's because I logged into one of the accounts that was on the phone or not, but hey. Um, and then I had a, a friend also tell me that they were able to uh, cart these easily as well. So you guys let me know, uh, is this something that you actually copped on Friday as well? Or was it something that you passed on? And if you did cop, how hard was it? So you guys know I like to give you my initial uh, thoughts of the shoe. Okay, maybe, maybe I need to take both out. Okay, there we go. So the first thing I notice, okay, is you guys know I like the extra laces. So we do get a pair of extra laces. So I'm vibing with that. Um, the tone, the tone of the shoe, the colors are, um, not as vibrant okay as i thought that they would be uh, it is more of a, a subtle subtle colors okay so not bad nothing over the top but not bad i'm gonna hold off until the end to let y'all know <laughs> how i feel about these so with that being said y'all y'all know what time it is let's put these in the mix okay 
Okay. Um, as far as the sizing, like I told you guys, this is my first pair. Uh, so I had to uh, ask the squad, you know, what should I do as far as sizing goes? And they said, go ahead and go that half a size up. Uh, like any other Adidas, they will run small. I um, mean, and, and it turned out to work perfectly for me. Glad I had those guys to uh, kind of guide me into uh, what I needed to do as far as sizing. So, uh, like I showed you guys, uh, we do get an extra set of laces there. That's going to be uh, green rope laces. And it looks like it has a bit of uh, pink running through them. So, uh, that's something that would be nice. Uh, to see how how it looks in there since we do have uh, that green in the outer sole okay and then you guys also get a size tag right there now let's jump on in it guys uh, so we do have that green outer sole uh, that's going to be rubber down there and as you guys can see uh, through that pattern, we do have that boost shining through. And uh, that's something about this sneaker that I think uh, validates that price point of uh, 220 So, not bad. Not bad. Okay. And obviously, guys, you know, with that green outer sole, uh, then we don't really have to worry about the bottom of the sneaker uh, getting extremely dirty as it would if it were uh, white. Now, underneath here, we have um, a little writing that actually says Adidas, the brand with the three stripes. And then we have a couple different languages under there, if you guys can see that. And then as we move into that mid, so it is a off-white tone, guys. And then, like I said before, we know that that's going to be boost right there. And then as we move into the upper, I'll start with this Cajun right here, guys. I think that that is another nice feature to this shoe. So it's going to be that light blue uh, lace Cajun. And it actually feeds into that midsole a little bit. So that's another aspect of the design that is something unique. Okay. Now, as we get up into that prime knit, we do have a couple color variations uh, but the first one that uh, dominates the sneaker is going to be a uh, maroon. So that's going to be on the bottom half of that upper. And like I said, that all is prime knit material. And then as we move around to uh, the front of this sneaker here, let's slide this uh, lace bag inside so you guys can kind of get a better view of the sneaker. Okay. So there is the front of this, and this one is the left sneaker. So you guys see there, it is the eye on this one. As we move up, we'll see the different variations of gray. So you'll get a light gray, and then you'll get a dark gray. And then we see that eye stitched in um, off-white. Now the pattern that goes around uh, the writing is circular. So uh, once we get towards the top, around that ankle, we'll start to see that maroon uh, color again. So right before the actual uh, collar in the sock liner, you still see a bit of that maroon. Now we do get a dark maroon that actually lines up around that ankle area. Now looking at the laces, what comes inside factory lace is going to be this yellow version, uh, which actually isn't a bad touch to me. Um, it actually allows the color to have a little more identity um, and a little more flavor to it, right? So I actually do like the yellow laces, but I'm interested to see uh, what the green laces will look like. So you guys know I'm going to give you a look of both. Okay, now as we get to the heel of this sneaker, then we also see uh, those laces tied in the back, which is a nice touch. And I definitely will be finishing those off in the back. So this will stay accordingly. Uh, we do see that maroon pattern back there. And as we get to the top here, you see there is a yellow tab up top with two stripes and then underneath it says Pharrell Williams. And then we see that maroon 
at the top lining the ankle. Now, as we move to the medial side of the sneaker, it will be identical um, as far as the patterns and the colors. The only change here is the design of uh, that blue lace caging. So it doesn't extend as far as it does on the lateral side, but I think that this is perfect. So now let's climb inside this shoe, y'all. There is some pattern in here. And let's see. I don't think that, yeah, these insoles are not easy to come out. It looks like it's actually stitched in there. So the way that they created this sneaker, it is not something that you're going to be taking out. It's interesting. But like I said, it's my first pair. So, um, you know, it's nice to see something a little different. I do believe it's going to be hard for you guys to actually see the detail of the insole, but let's try. See there, it is green and then you see the boost coming through there, but it's actually some writing in there also. So it has the three stripes. It also has the Adidas logo. Um, at the very back towards the heel, it says pelvis. Okay. And then I see kidneys, liver, bladder. Okay. Diaphragm. Shoulder. Okay, so basically <laughs> your major parts of the body, right? And then, um, as you guys can see, that sock liner is a blue. Okay. Now, with this sneaker, uh, the left and the right has two different uh, letterings on the top. So I'm actually going to let you guys see the right side as well. Okay. Now, taking a look at the right sneaker, we have extra Okay, so this was known as the Light Aqua or the Extra Eye. Um, now, there was another pair that also dropped. Um, I think it was members only access or it was a draw or something, if I'm not mistaken. Um, but that one was a orange tone and it's supposed to still be a part of the Extra Eye um, pack. But it actually is in another language. So I thought that this pair was dope because I could actually see, you know, the extra eye. Um, and I, I like the writing versus, you know, the uh, letters of a different language. Uh, for whatever reason being, um, that's something that draws my eye a little bit more. So uh, this definitely was the pair that I was after. So now that we're at the end, guys. Oh. Another item that's different is on the heel there, we actually see the Adidas in that yellow tab up top. And let me see if the insole has anything different. Nope, that still has colon, kidneys, spleen, stomach. So there are some different words that are more visible on this side. So putting them next to each other, there you guys go. Get a good look there. And then the back. And something on the front here uh, that I just noticed. Let's see if I can get an up close view for you guys. If you guys can see right there on that green rubber, you'll see an L on the left one with numbers, and then you'll see an R on the right one with numbers. I don't know what that signifies. It is the same number, so it could be the color coding for the sneaker. 
could be. Um, I'm not very sure on that aspect, but yeah, first pair, guys, not bad. Not bad for the first pair at retail. Not bad at all. I will say uh, the next pair that I look for uh, will probably be more of uh, vibrant colors. So, or it may be one solid color. It just truly depends on what the message on the top of the sneaker says. Um, that will probably have a lot to do with what I go after. Um, and then the colorway will be the second deciding factor. But most importantly, message first, colorway second. So, not bad at all, guys. I want you guys to let me know what are your thoughts. Like I said earlier, was this, if you did cop, was it easy? So were these overlooked due to the Carbon 350s also releasing on the same day, okay? But I appreciate you guys. Before we head out of here, there's some housekeeping things we have to do. So make sure you guys have hit that like button and also subscribe and turn on that notification bell because we have a lot going on. Uh, myself and the squad, we tend to go uh, live a lot of days throughout the week. So you don't want to miss out on anything. And then I always have a Rewind Wednesday segment. Uh, we missed last week, so this week should be full of interesting and exciting things for you guys to see. And on Rewind Wednesday, guys, uh, that's where I actually show a lot of sneakers. I don't do uh, reviews on everything that I get in. Uh, there has been quite a few dunks that I actually showed to the viewers on Rewind Wednesday that I never did a review on. So you guys want to make sure that you stay tuned in so you don't miss out on any of our pickups, y'all. Okay? So, with that out the way, let me go ahead and give y'all what y'all want. <laughs> Let's get into this on foot. Got plans. I gotta make up for this lost time and I'm late Trying to get back to you 